solve system of linear equations using matrix method x minus y plus z is equal to 4 2x plus y minus 3z is equal to 0 x plus y plus z is equal to 2 the given equations we can also represent it as 1 negative 1 and 1 2 1 and negative 3 1 1 and 1 as the coefficients the coefficient matrix and the variables are x y z x y and z which is equal to the constants are here 4 0 2 so we can say this is ax is equal to b and we know that matrix method if the given system is ax is equal to b then x is equal to a inverse into b provided the determinant of a is not equal to 0 and we know a inverse is equal to 1 by delta a into adjoint of matrix a let's find the determinant whether the given system is having a solution unique solution or not determinant of a is equal to delta of 1 minus 1 1 2 1 and negative 3 1 1 and 1 which is equal to 1 times of 1 negative of negative 3 that is plus 3 and minus of minus 1 times of 2 into 1 2 negative 1 and 2 negative 3 is 1 into negative 3 is negative 3 so minus of minus plus 3 and plus 1 times of 2 1 are 2 minus 1 so we can write 4 2 plus 3 that is 5 2 minus 1 that is 1 so 5 plus 1 6 6 plus 4 is 10 which is not equal to 0 so we can say that a inverse a determinant of a is not equal to 0 so the given system is having unique solution so ax is equal to be the system have unique solution now let's find the adjoint of a matrix adjoint of a matrix is transpose of the cofactor of matrix cofactor cofactor matrix of a and to the transpose let's find the cofactor matrix by using shortcut method let's take the elements from second row from the co coefficient matrix second row second column element that starts from 1 1 negative 3 and again 2 1 negative 3 2 and again 1 and third row 1 the next element is 1 and again 1 and the next element is 1 and coming to the first row negative 1 1 1 and negative 1 and coming back to the second row that's 1 negative 3 2 and 1 so now we can use the determinants 1 into 1 1 negative 1 in negative minus of 1 into negative 3 is plus 3 so 1 plus 3 is 4 so i can write here 4 and next minus 3 minus 2 it's negative 5 and 2 into 1 2 2 minus 1 is 1 and here 1 1 is a 1 plus 1 that's 2 and 1 1 is a 1 minus 1 it's a 0 1 into negative 1 is minus 1 minus 1 is minus 2 and here 1 minus 1 into negative 3 is 3 3 minus 1 is 2 and 2 1 is a 2 2 plus 3 it's 5 and 1 into 1 is 1 plus 2 3 to the transpose so we can write adjoint of a matrix is 4 2 and 2 negative 5 0 and 5 interchanging the rows and columns 1 minus 2 and 3 and now let's find the a inverse 1 by delta into a inverse is equal to 1 by delta into adjoint of a matrix that is 4 2 2 minus 5 0 5 1 minus 2 and 3 and hence now x is equal to a inverse into b let's write x is equal to 1 by 10 4 2 and 2 negative 5 0 5 and 1 negative 2 and 3 it's multiplied with the constant matrix that is 4 0 2 which is equal to 
1 upon 10 times a row with column 4 into 4 16 plus 2 into 0 0 plus 2 into 2 it's 4 second row with column negative 5 into 4 is negative 20 plus 0 into 0 is 0 5 into 2 is 10 and third row with column 1 into 4 it's 4 plus minus 2 into 0 it's plus 0 plus 3 into 2 is 6 so we can write 1 upon 10 times 16 plus 4 is 20 minus 20 plus 10 is negative 10 and 6 plus 4 is again 10 so we can write 20 upon 10 minus 10 upon 10 and 10 upon 10 which is equal to 2 negative 1 and 1 so the variable matrix x y z is equal to 2 negative 1 and 1 so in comparing both matrices x is equal to 2 y is equal to negative 1 and z is equal to 1 is the solution okay thank you